you don't have to be right all the time. Imagine how much time and energy and emotion that you can save by not striving to be right all the time. What I mean by this is when we're having conversations and we're talking with people um, or we're arguing with people um, or having an opinion about something and what tends to happen is the focus of the conversation can lead to always wanting to be right. So uh, an argument can come up because one side thinks X and another side thinks Y um, and both sides spend so much time and energy and emotion on wanting to be the person that's right. Imagine how much time and energy you save by not doing that, by not having to spend that energy, spend that emotion, get frustrated because um, you're trying to get your word in all the time, because you're trying to be right all the time. Imagine where you could use that or reuse that time and energy elsewhere in your life. So imagine, you know, you spent half an hour a day arguing the toss about something because you want to be right about it. What if, well, for one, what does that actually gain you by being right, by shouting from the rafters and um, trying to s speak louder than anyone else because that proves to you that you're right? What does that achieve? Where does that progress you? What kind of needle does that move in your life? Like, what what benefits do you actually get from it? Or you can look at it as that half an hour that you spend every day trying to be right, what if you were to channel that energy and time and effort into doing something else, doing something that actually makes you feel better, okay? So that's half an hour a day, that's uh, times seven, that's three and a half hours a week, three and a half hours, that's seven, that's 14 hours a month, 14 hours a month spent doing something else that is going to be to your long-term benefit, to your health, fitness and happiness. Like how much better would that time be spent? How much better would that energy and effort be spent? Like it's really quite negative energy to always be arguing to the point of trying to be right all the time, okay? So it's a it's a subtle change it's a subtle shift in mindset and attitude but it's a powerful one really powerful it's about redirecting your focus and putting your energy into something else something worth your time something worth your energy something worth getting fired up about i.e something that is going to take 14 hours a week uh, or 14 hours of your life up that you could be spending now so that, you know, in a week, in a month, in a year's time, you get the cumulative benefit of it. Or you can continue always arguing and trying to be right all the time, spending 14 hours a month for the next 40, 50 years. Where Where's that time going to go? It's going to go like that and it's going to be in this negative space as well. So I would much rather, I would much rather um, not have to be right and channel that energy and channel all of that frustration into doing something else, into doing something that is to my long-term benefit or to the benefit of all of those around me as well. Because, you know, it's not just about us, it's about how we lead by example to all of those around us, whether it's friends, whether it's colleagues, whether it's family, okay? Lead by example. Take, take a stand by not having to be right all the time, by not striving to be right, 
and intent instead channel that energy channel that focus into another aspect of your life which is to do something that is going to be to your health fitness and happiness benefit okay that is my friday night thought for the week um, i hope you have a great week um, and if you have any comments queries questions um, then drop them below if you have gotten value from listening to this podcast or watch this youtube video um, then hit the subscribe button and if you want to get in contact then hit or dial or whatsapp me on this number up here okay so in summary don't waste your time and energy focusing on always trying to be right there's the operative word trying right you might not actually be right but you might be trying to argue the toss about being right whereas you're not right and then there's just this whole waste of time i see versus rechanneling redirecting that energy into something that is worthwhile okay are you going to look back in 40 50 years time and think oh, i'm so glad that was right all of those times or are you going to think i'm so glad that i spent that time doing something else that made me feel better that made um the environment that i live in better that just made me and everyone else happier okay that's the choice it's it's a it's not a finite choice but we can lean into doing that more than doing the other thing okay so let me know what you think um that's my attitude anyway have a great great friday